Francis Tiafo now the face of a new generation of American tennis champions. The youngest American man to advance to the U.S. Open quarterfinals since 2005. At the Junior Tennis Champion Center in College Park, where his dad once managed the maintenance group. I was so proud of him because we worked so hard. Tiafo's old coach cannot stop smiling. This story of his life, yeah. it's like the American dream. That's right. He, his dad was a custodian here. Yep. He, he helped build this place. Tiafo's face gazes down from the JTCC wall of champions. The center's framed the New York Times cover stories about his success. But for up and coming young players, Tiafo's not just an image on the TV screen. It's very hard to take Francis serious. <laughs> Even though he's so serious on court. He's the guy who is always stopping by to play around with them. You never really see Francis uh, down or mad or anything. So when I'm down, he always like cracks a smile or joke with me, play with me or like uh, throw a piece of paper at me or something like that. It's nice to see someone that came up from the same place as me just do something so incredible. The Alfo's discipline rooted in ambition for himself and his parents. Immigrants from Sierra Leone. Mom was working two jobs as a nurse and, and Pop's working there. You know, 24 7. Now he's energizing the next generation. I think that's definitely the most inspirational part about him, really. Came from practically nothing and is now one of the top players in the world. Could he be the next Nadal? I can say, yeah. The quarterfinal, Wednesday at 1. In College Park, Bruce Lachan, WUSA 9.